Here's a challenge. Can I fit an HF antenna in this bag? One that's ready to go, not something that needs to be unrolled or unpacked. The most obvious choice is a rectangular magnetic loop. This is a metre of aluminium strip, though the dimensions are not critical. Just enough to fit into your bag is sufficient. You'll notice some dimensions, 13 centimetres, 23, 28, 23 and 13. This is where the bends need to be. It's not quite rectangular, but it's pretty good. And it can just fit in the case. The connection of the feed line is a bit makeshift. The braid is screwed to the center of the bottom edge of the loop. The inner goes to a wire, about 15 or 20 centimeters long. I'm using a fuse holder as a temporary contact to near the corner of the bottom edge of the loop but I will replace it with a screw later on once I've found a permanent position. The compression trimmer is almost all the way in on 7 megahertz. I would estimate it's around a thousand picofarad. If you don't have a trimmer that big, you can use a fixed capacitor. You'll have to find the value by experiment. And then a smaller variable capacitor for the final fine adjustment. I'm on the second level here in my home and I have to run some fairly large um, cabling down the cavity into the, into the ground space. I had R. Because the loop's not going to be very efficient, I'll first of all try Whisper on 7 megahertz with 5 watts. Seven megahertz was successful. What about ten megahertz? The trimmer's high minimum capacitance means that the only bands I was able to get the loop to resonate on were seven and ten megahertz. If you were to substitute a smaller trimmer, you would cover all bands up to fifty megahertz proved since I've built larger loops that resonate on that frequency. The temporary clip has been removed and a more permanent connection added, though you might want to make it stiff rather than flexible wire. Efficiency is very low, but for small size this antenna is unbeatable. Not only for whisper transmitting, but also for casual receiving.